If you go to put your card in the ATM and it seems harder to insert than usual, don't ignore that warning sign. I'm your Nina Neighborhood Reporter, Debbie McCarthy, with more on a card skimming crime in the area. If you pay attention to the machine, you might be able to see, but they're made to make it so that it's hard to detect them. If you are a Prospera Credit Union client in Nina or Menasha, you may have gotten an upsetting call recently. We discovered skimming devices on three of our ATMs. It happened at various times between October 17th and October 24th. Some Prospera Credit Union customers' card information was compromised by a device called a card skimmer. A skimming device is something that somebody is putting on to any kind of card reader. It doesn't have to be an ATM um, that is used for the purpose of taking card numbers and PIN numbers. According to a Winnebago County criminal complaint, a 28-year-old Romanian man whose ID named him Misha Karan was seen on security footage inserting this device into some of their ATMs. The complaint also states that video shows Karan was joined by a 13-year-old boy who the complaint states has family in Dallas, Texas, but he came to Wisconsin, quote, to hang out with some girls. According to the complaint, when police searched Karan at the time of his arrest, they found pliers, a surveillance camera box, $1,630 in U.S. currency, 16 Visa credit cards, and four receipts for denied transactions. We requested the video footage from Prospera, but they have not been able to respond to that request at this time. However, they did say all affected cardholders were contacted. We were lucky that the number of unauthorized transactions was really, really low. Police say crimes using this kind of device are very rare in this area. A Nina Police Department crime analyst says there are no records of other cases involving skimming devices in Nina. But to make sure this doesn't happen to you, Prospera Marketing Director Krista Gordon says to pay attention to your surroundings. Look for well-lit ATMs. Pay attention to the machine itself. You know, does something seem off? If something seems off, Gordon says don't use it. Also, cover the pin pad when entering your numbers to protect them from hidden cameras, which the criminal complaint states were used in this case. As for Karan, his preliminary hearing is set for next week.